Hello and welcome to Learning Science. In this video, I will show you how you can convert a Power BI table into a CSV format. Let us jump to the computer for the demo. Let me show you my data table first. So this is my data table, business segment, category, color, and sales amount. So I will convert this table into a CSV format. So let me go back to report page and here I will add a table visual. I will add all the columns from sales by category table, which I want to convert into a CSV format. Category, color and sales amount. So all my column is added here. From modeling tab, I will go to new major. So new major, I will name it as CSV. And here I will use a DAX function to CSV. OK. Now first parameter is table name. So this is sales by category is my table name. The second parameter is number of record you want to return. So it is optional, so I'll say keep as blank. And basically now the third parameter is how your column value is separated. So basically CSV has a comma separated format. So I will put a comma into a double quote. And the last parameter is you want a heading or you don't want. So I'll say I don't want heading, so I'll say false. Now close the bracket and press enter. And I will add a one more table visual here. And I will bring this major here in the table. So here you can see the second row from first table bike. You can see bike, mountain bike, mountain bike, comma, color black and. Sales amount. So now this is comma separated. Now if you want to export it into CSV file from here, three dots, you click and you say export data. It will be exported into a CSV file. Now we will revisit to the major again and we'll see if you want to return a three row. So here just add a three. So you can see now three rows. Now if you want to add a heading, you say true. So hit the enter button. And heading is added, but heading is Column heading is not directly. First is a table name and then column heading. So now let me show you Microsoft documentation. So this is Microsoft documentation for uh, two CSV DAX function. So here you can see all the four parameters. Which we have already discussed. That's all for this video. I request you to please subscribe my channel. Thank you for watching.